Well, you probably heard I would like another debate, so I'm hoping the former vice president will agree to that. But we have a lot more to discuss. You, you raised 27 million from this fundraiser. That's the largest since you raised um, since you were at the top of the ticket. That's a lot of money. How are you feeling about that? And well, it's, it's showing that there's a lot of support for our message and, and what we need to do in terms of you know, moving forward and charting a new way forward and dispensing with all of the attempts to divide our country and and to just, you know, really, I, the, the problem, I think, on the other side is that there is a, a devaluation of who the American people are. I just don't really understand that we've got a lot of good people in our country who want to work hard and do well. and want a leader who believes that we are, you know, in this together, and I do. So I'm going to be giving a speech this week that is uh, really just to outline my vision for the economy. As you've heard me talk about, I believe in what we can create in terms of opportunity for the American people. I've named it an opportunity economy, which really, uh, in short form, is about what we can do more to invest in the aspirations, the ambitions, and the dreams of the American people while addressing the challenges that they face, whether it be the high price of groceries or the difficulty in being able to acquire home ownership. Join me on the debate stage. Let's have another debate. There's more to talk about, and the voters of America deserve uh, to hear the conversations that I think we should be having on substance, on issues, on policies. What's your plan? What's my plan? And, um, and we should have another one before Election Day. So thank you all. Thank you. Thank you.